Hello YouTube, this is 234 Super Pokemon and today I'm going to be showing how to draw this my made up Pokemon. Huh? Well, here he is and now I'm going to show you how to draw him. Okay, here H577 is directing the camera. Start off with a circle for his body like with all my Pokemon drawings. See? For his arm. I actually think 234 Super Pokemon is getting better at drawing his circles. If you agree, like this video. For his arms. Now the other line. I'm going to erase that later. Alright, now for the next arm. That's the TV, by the way. He did not, by choice, have that music on. Alright, next up, start right here. Draw a line behind him. Come down. Draw his little cape. I don't really know why I put the cape there. It just felt like it, because his pre-evolution had it. Are we drawing the second evolution or the first? Second evolution, Greg. Mm -hmm. Dragon Rage. Uh, well, here's the second evolution. You only got the first evolution in the camera. That's who you're going to be drawing. Pretty cool, right? Alright, keep right. drawing. Now let's keep going for his mouth. Draw just a straight line. Come down, make it a circle. For his teeth, two lines. Now put his eyes. Two smaller circles. <laughs> All right. Next, right here. That. And over here. So these are his ears, right? Yeah. Those are both of them have that on their head. Now get this. So I'm using just a normal pencil right now. My lead pencil has no eraser on it. So we'll we'll color it. Hey, can I do the coloring? Sure. All right, that's how you draw it with pencil. This, oh, and guys, this will just be um, shiny form, okay? So the color where it's red, it will be blue, and where it's pink or purple, I can't really tell, it will be orange. So Grant's going to do the, I mean, Dragon Rage 577. I don't know why I was calling him Grant. That's a little boy from a fourth grade feeling. Okay, let's go. Let's move on. Remember, you gotta use the black marker to outline it. Okay, 234 Super Pokemon. Here we go. First, we're gonna start with the outlining now. Make sure to put your best into your drawings in any drawing you do. I think that's why 234 Super Pokemon is getting really, really good at these drawings because he's actually trying more than he used to when he was smaller. Used to, I just do Dragon Ball drawing, Dragon Ball Z drawings, but once I noticed I was never, I was never getting any better at those, and I couldn't figure out how to draw them in different poses. I just moved on to these. Yeah, and he can draw these in different poses. Really, really good. I think he comes up with new Pokemon every day. I do. I make a new video of Pokemon every day. And I am... Right now, my parents have taken away my YouTube account for a week because I made a unacceptable C... C minus in my reading class, so. Aww. So, yeah, they hate when I make a C minus or, um. Really anything under a B. Yeah. Really anything actually, probably an 85 under. Yeah. If I know them. They hate that. He's about to be done outlining. 
I'm sorry that some that my black marker sometimes looks like a blue, uh, like a bluish in the camera. I don't know why it does that. I think it's because I have the brightness set to my. Okay, now we just erase that excess pencil everywhere, every now and then. Now we're going to be doing whatever is red is going to be blue, and whatever's pink is going to be orange. So we're going to go ahead and make the ears blue. This will be shiny, shiny, um, I think it's Psych Halo. Just watch my video drawing number six, or I mean drawing number seven, and you'll see his name. I kind of don't, I really don't take time to remember all his one's names. I just put them on the videos and move on. And aren't all shiny versions worth more in, in the DS game? Yeah. They're more powerful. Hey, then my shiny Gyarados can kick butt. The red Gyarados, that's just a normal. You can get that Pokemon in every game. Yes, but it's shiny. Yes, it's in every game. It's not. The shiny red Gyarados is really not that rare in Pokemon games. If you find a shiny starter Pokemon, that's really rare. <coughs> Yeah, like on um, Pokemon Crater or something or other. Um, I have a shiny Pampalark and a shiny uh, Trico. Oh, I didn't know they put you, the black and white Pokemon on there. Yep. Yeah, they got both versions. <coughs> so, here we go. We're almost done with our shiny whatever his name is looking pretty good we're, we're watching good oh, little charlie right now and for shading grit try taking a darker orange and go over that spot right there which spot from here to down right here that you had me more of the right side yeah kind of like shiny spartan Mm -hmm. Shiny Spartan is a really good drawer. He mostly favors shading the right side for some reason. But all of his drawings after that come out to be really nice. Thumbs up for Shiny Spartan. He's the reason I started drawing. Pokemon. Thank you. Okay, so now I'm going to need a darker orange on the dark white oranges, so I'll just go over again with the orange on the right. So, wait a minute, use this to make it darker. It's not the darkest orange I have, but it will make it. Kind of like this? Yeah, that's making it darker. Right. Now go over, yeah. Now go up a little back and make a line back up to the arm. And then you'll be done. Yep, that's good. Okay, that is... Here, turn it right side up so they can see it. See the final result. Can I see it good? Mm-hmm. That is shiny Psychiwakiwaka, whatever his name is. Look at drawing number six on the 234. Drawing number seven. Drawing number seven. And that's it. Thanks. 234 is your Pokemon and Dragon Rage 577 signing off.